first date can be a whirlwind, but that doesn't make it impossible to tell if you have chemistry. And today's Manly Minute Kid has five signs to first date success. Yeah. Kind of like a checklist I want you to take with you as you head on out and uh, into that uh, initial foray into this uh, dating scene. So you'll be able to tell how things are going along as you take a look at this checklist to make your way through the evening. If you get midway through and you're not checking things off, eh, you might just want to get up and go home. All right, here we go. Number one, the pre-date signs. Did he or she, did they call you or text you before the date to be like, hey, are we still on for today? If you don't get that pre-date check-in, that person is probably not as excited about the date as you would like them to be. So look for the pre-date signs. Do they check in? Do they double check to make sure you guys are meeting at the right place or the time is confirmed? Things like that to make sure that they're actually invested in this evening going well, just as invested as you are. Number two, here's where we go. It went longer than planned. Slow down. I'm not talking about breakfast the next morning. I'm saying that it went a little bit longer, like you got to go to a movie, and then you decided, hey, you know what? Uh, you want to get some coffee? Things like that. That extending the evening, and things went a bit longer than you thought they were going to go. You ended up going to different places, spending more time together because you're having so much fun. They didn't want the evening to end. That's always a great sign that they want to continue to hang out and do things for you. All right, number three. You had things in common. You met and you found out oh, we're both complete like nerds and we love the holidays. Woohoo! Like, it's really hard to find things in common, especially specific things. And so you get there on that date and you find, oh my goodness, we have so much in common. Now you know you're on the right track. You know this date is going very well. You found something in common. The next sign is the absolute guaranteed sign things are golden for you. You had her attention. Now look, everybody has, when they go on a first date, they've got that friend that calls to give them the out so oh, they can leave right. the day early if they need to. <laughs> yes. I'm not making this up, right? Everybody's no, got not. this. Yep. And so when the phone rings in the middle of dinner, she's like, what? Oh my goodness, I've got to go. <laughs> There's a nap for that too, just so you know. <laughs> Wait, are you serious? Yes. That is hilarious. <laughs> okay, now look, full disclosure, I ain't gonna lie, my brother and I used to have that set up between two <laughs> I'd be like, hey man, call me at 9.30 and see how things are going. <laughs> yeah. If it wasn't going well, I'd be like, what? Your car's broken down. Oh. I gotta go help my brother. <laughs> but, so, but if you had her attention the whole time, that's great. That's a good, she didn't check her phone or anything. Man, you are golden at that point. So and then funny. here's the last thing to think about. So at the end of the evening, you said, hey, text me when you get inside, text me when you get home. And she does. She does follow up and checks in with you after she gets home. And then that usually leads to a second date. So if you can get all those first five things to happen <laughs> right. and you didn't get that word phone call 30 minutes into the date that says she's got to go, <laughs> you're golden. That's five things to think about, a checklist to have with you for your first date success. To find out more, go to gooddaysacramento.com. Click on show info for today's date and man up for not having your brother call and get you out of trouble. Good day continues after this. Carry the heavy load